Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play The Walking Dead. Last time we talked to Chuck, he gave us a plan. We need to do this plan. And for some reason you can still go into this screen. Enough to get oh. work at once. Never mind, I guess you can't. You and me, we... Oh, fuck. Let's just get to the ocean. You still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Care. It's the best plan. It's full of maps and documents. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kitty? Can you just leave me alone? Hey. Yeah. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure... Cat. The, uh... Okay with you, so forget it. Okay. Hmm. For some reason, I'm not remembering how to get Kenny out of the way so he can get the map. There's got to be something that can be done. Hey, Ben. Hey. Aren't many of us left? Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Are you gonna be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. See ya. Yeah. The door to the boxcar. Oh, right. That's how you do it, I think. Wait. Maybe? I don't know. I hope we're not on this train much longer. Looks like Chuck has some booze left. It's a fifth of whiskey. He's lived here a while. There's some scissors in Chuck's bag. They look clean enough. We're gonna try and get everything first, though. found those scissors in your pack. Oh, good. Get to snipping. Hey, yo. I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Sure. Not known for its finish. Little kid. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Yo. Where do you even say hey? Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. Yeah. 
There, that's how you get Kenny out of the way. So you can take these maps. Keep an eye out up here. Sure. Okay then. I want to go see if maybe we can talk to him out here. Oh no, nope, guess not. Maybe Chuck will have something else to say. There was a map of Savannah in the cab. That's where I would look. I'll talk it over with Clementine. Make sure she's got a sense of things by the time we arrive. Good. Yo. That's so weird that it's not saying hey anymore. Well, apparently you can't talk to them. I was wondering if maybe you could get a little bit more backstory into Kenny. But apparently not. Let's ask Ben if he wants hey, to drink. Ben. Hey. See you. Yeah. Or not. It was me. Huh? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me. Kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. You still want to talk to me? Yeah, I do. I'm real sorry. Let's drop it for now, okay? What are you doing out here? I, uh, couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. Anything else? I was thinking about talking to Kenny. I guess not. I'm dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. You get why, right? I guess. You better. See ya. Yeah. Oops, I forgot to start the timer on this one, so hopefully it won't go too far. I did. He had some, uh, he explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. Don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? I know these are just bottles, but you have to aim for the head. I know. Only the head. Unless it's not a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then? Head or body. Anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. It might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. 
Okay, this part gets a little difficult because you can't control it. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. <coughs> you okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Let's see. A bit to the right. Okay, a little higher. I got it! Excellent. Good shot. The trick is you have to know where she's shooting. See how it was too high, so now you want to aim left. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. And a bit lower. Aim lower. Oops. A bit to the right. Aim more to the right. Close. Now keep it steady. There you go. Just nice. like that. Yeah, you did. Good job. I just pretended they were walker heads. Good. Just like you should. They're not walkers, though. No. Far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. So that's the first part of what you gotta do with Clementine. Now... Let's show her the map. Hey, Clint. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're going to do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. You need to know if they're okay. Well, if they're not, what happened to them? I'm sure they're okay. Don't get your hopes up. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm... Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. A lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M... M... something... Mar... Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I... tell my parents? You know... Sure. Go ahead. I don't know what she was getting at. Maybe about him being a killer? I don't know. Hey, Clint. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it, and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Mind if we do this now? 
I guess not. Don't mow. It's a good thing. Do you know how to do this? How hard can it be? I'm going to look like a boy. Just now. So you did kill someone before? Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Killing is bad no matter what. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. Doesn't make it good. But you have to. I do it because it's necessary. Walkers aren't people. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with some. Here. I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There. All set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far- Oh, shit! Hold on, everybody! That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm. I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This? Yo! You keep screaming like that, and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could've just kept walking. No, we're friendly! Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of him. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there, we won't let them escape. Okay, so we'll do this part here too. We'll be down here. Leads up to that wrecked tanker. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves! I guess you'll have to find out. Not reassuring. <laughs> a group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now? What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Hey, I'm not gonna bullshit you. Our group is a little fucked right now. We had a bite victim. And his mom took a life, and before that, just... It's okay. Oh, shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is great! See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? 
to me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened, I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I, uh, didn't make it that far. And everybody down there, they're cool? Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know, uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. That train is awesome, though. That tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it, but if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Okay. So let's check up here real quick. It's empty. Oh, we can't talk to Clementine. Let's go talk to your people, man. Oh, me? What? Am I gonna have to tell your people the plan or what? Maybe. I don't think so. This thing is mangled to hell. No releasing it. No nothing. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Okay. So we're probably not going to go ahead and tell anybody the plan yet. We're just looking around for stuff. Mm, oh, there's a door. Folks probably had that way with that van a while ago. That's about the only useful thing in here. Yeah, nobody needs stop signs or cones or Empty. anything. That's what I figured. Alright guys. So like I said, really sorry if the video went long or wasn't long enough, but I did forget to set the timer, so I basically just wanted to get that out of the way. There's probably going to be one more part, because I do remember how this ends now, and it's very close to ending. So come on back in the next video, which should be the finale of episode 3. As always, my name is Fitivus Prime. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, give it a like. And if you like my channel, go ahead and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video of The Walking Dead. Later.